Hi, I'm Jonathan Price, bringing you a public service announcement on a menace that has invaded our homes. This menace goes by one name only. Video games. Hey, you thought? Is this supposed to be smoking? Jonathan. Yeah, John. Yeah, it's definitely. Oh, it's it's on fire. It's it's definitely on fire. Can we get someone on this? I. Do we have a hose or I. So uh, you guys see that new uh, intern? What's her name? Sarah. John. She's something, right? John. Oh, hot. What was that? We're rolling. Yeah, sure we are, doll. <laughs> We're rolling. The violent video games of today are corrupting America's youth, causing, leading, no even forcing them to repeat these heinous activities in real life. I'm talking, of course, about video games such as Pac-Man and Space Invaders. Let's take a look at one child in Wyoming who has been particularly affected by these video games. This is 15-year-old Billy who is suffering from extreme video game violence exposure. Just look at how it is affected. And we're rolling. Horrific. Now, let's take a look at the other side of these video game related incidents. This shocking footage was taken in the town of Andale, not far from Washington, D.C., where children, after playing the game Space Invaders, went out and mercilessly beat a local alien inhabitant into submission. And an interview with real live ghosts harbors frightening results as well. So, what's it like being a ghost in this day and age? How have the recent Pac-Man and Miss Pac-Man games affected your day-to-day -day lives? Are you ever afraid to leave your home? Thank you for your time. As you can see, violent video games have a profound effect on our children and the victims of these heinous crimes. And while I don't believe that this video game fad will be around for much longer, until then, I suggest we take the advice of Socrates and fight fire with fire. And by fire, I mean violence. This has been a public service announcement on video game violence. Jonathan Price, signing out. No, that's slander. I never said that. Excuse me, Mr. Price. Yeah, what? Socrates never said fight fire with fire. What do you mean, Socrates never said fight fire with fire? Can we have a from there?